glad I was spared like the very last pair. When you walk into the mall and you think they ain't there. So you say a little prayer. You don't want to be so vain. But if I get them in my hands, I'll give them. Hey, what is popping, everybody? Welcome to the channel. It is your boy, Truth. And today we have an on feet look at the Air Max 90. I think they're the duck camos or something like that. But it's been a couple of different names for these joints. But these did recently drop. On the sneakers app, but this is the 2019 pair that originally dropped for Air Max Day. And uh, I just wanted to show you guys, if you, because if you're on the fence about it, y'all know how we do over here. If you're on the fence about it, we're going to go over sizing, comfortability, and all those great things. But before we get up into this content, man, make sure you guys hit that subscribe Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button for your boy. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. Head over to IG. Follow your boy at Kicknology on IG. And Kicknology23 on Snapchat. I would greatly appreciate it. Hit that like button. Helps with the algorithm. Helps the channel to continue to grow. I greatly appreciate you guys. I love you guys. Now, as we start with the lateral side on this left shoe, as you guys can see, you have your traditional Air Max 90. This one has that camo vibes on the side. You see what I'm saying? But... They remind me of the Baby Apes. Like, y'all remember when the Baby Apes had all the camo and stuff on the side, toe box. This is what this reminds me of. You have the black Nike swoosh, the white outsole with the infrared air bubble unit right there. As we head on the back end of these sneakers, you guys can see right here, we do have that black and infrared Nike traditional Air Max 90 silhouette wrapped in that camo. So as you guys can see over here, same exact thing. As we go to the right side of the sneaker, exact same thing on the right side of the sneaker. Um, as we look on the inner side of the shoe, as you guys can see right here, the Nike Swoosh stays the same. They didn't change anything up on it. They did keep it the exact same as the outer side. Now, as we take a look at the front of the sneaker, as you guys can see, we have white laces. They did come with another set of laces on these things, and I will show you guys. But they do have the white laces in here with the mesh netting, the infrared mesh netting on the toe box. I love the mesh netting on the Air Max 90s. Just give it that vintage, original look. On the tongue, we do have the Nike Air on the tongue, as you guys can see right here, wrapped in that camo. Super good material. You got some black nubuck right here that starts from the toe box to the laces and just the overall clean clean sneaker as we look at the bottom of them Like I said, these are from 2019. So they are worn You just have your traditional Air Max outsole with that red and black on there now as far as comfortability and sizing Let's start with sizing. I'm gonna say true to size for me Air Max 90s all of my Air Max 90s are true to size 11.5 if I can't get 11.5 I go 12. I do not go a size down. They are too small so true to size or half a size up, in my opinion. Now, when we talk about comfortability of these things, just how comfortable they are, I feel like the Air Max 90 silhouette has always been a comfortable sneaker. So I'm going to rank all my Air Max 90s in the same thing, which is going to be an 8 out of 10. It's going to be an 8 out of 10 because they are running shoes and they do give you that support. And that, that everyday wear, you can actually wear them out a lot. So I do feel like that an 8 is suffice. You know what? Let's switch it up to 8.5. We're going to go with 8.5 just because I feel like they, that 0. .5 means a lot. You know what I'm saying? But these shoes... Are actually sitting depending on the area that you're in. They sold out on sneakers app, which I was shocked by that. But they are sitting in some areas. So if you happen to walk to your finish line, Foot Locker Champs, mainly Foot Lockers and Champs, you probably will be able to cop these things without a problem. And resale definitely ain't that much for them, also. But let's go ahead and take a look at the box and, and a closer look at these sneakers, and then we'll close out the video. All right, so when it comes with the box, you have your traditional Nike box, the orange label Nike box right here. Um, the size tag, as you guys can see right here, this is a size 12 just because there was 11.5 was sold out on Air Max Day, so I did go the half a size up, but I'm still sticking with the fact that true to size, you can actually go with these sneakers. You feel what I'm saying? Now, as we open up this box, right here um these are the inserts that come in the shoes as far as those things and then of course they give us this nike air hang tag on them and they came with the infrared laces and the black laces and they do come in the nike bag so make sure you guys are checking that out as you guys are getting your shoes in the aftermarket they're going to call the control sticker right there on them and that is it for the box all right, so again, here's the shoe up close and personal. I just wanted to show you guys a closer look on it. The Nike swoosh on the side, as you can see, is like a snakeskin type thing. Shiny leather material, which is super dope. And then on the toe box, I told you guys this material is like a nice.
nice suede a new book right here so premium material on these things the sock liner is pretty thick pretty plush um the back end of them like i said just super nice looking clean sneaker as we give you guys a 360 on it and that mesh toe box is always a plus in the air max 90s in my opinion but y'all let me know down in the comment section what are your thoughts and opinions about this sneaker retail was 140 if i'm not mistaken so not too bad won't break the bank and, and, and as i said if you are actually in the market for this sneaker and you're just watching this video to rip to see if you should cop i would definitely say this is a great air max 90 a must have to have in your collection that's all i got for you guys make sure you guys go ahead and hit that subscribe button for your boy and y'all already know the sayings man rock what you like not what's hype and remember everything we talk about including these joints right here are just bait worth for me to share my faith i'm gonna catch y'all next video gone get it get they ready we'll let you know if you should go and get a we got back we got two never slack